Hey, what's up guys? Tom is back with another Linsense video. Today we have a fragrance from Hamidi, but before we get into that, just want to say thank you guys again. It is an honor to be playing on one of those electronic devices, whether it's that cell phone, that tablet, that laptop, that Macintosh, that brand new big screen TV, whether you watch me at home, at work, on a plane, a train, or an automobile. Maybe you're watching me right next to some type of body of water, whether it's a pool, a lake, an ocean, a pond, a uh, a canal who knows man if you guys watch me there you guys are fortunate to have some beautiful weather to enjoy those things get out there enjoy them now before fall gets here before that cool weather gets here nonetheless if you guys are new to this channel you like what you see hit the subscribe button comment and like likes are very very important now Hamidi now the last time I did a fragrance from Hamidi it was this bad boy right here this is addicted imperial okay now, some of you guys thought, uh, a few of you in the comments said you thought it was a Millicium Imperial fragrance clone. And then uh, I think I got one that said it's Aventus for her. And actually, I'm going to go with Aventus for her because they do have the Aventus clone as well, which we will get into. They also have two others in this addicted lineup. They have Madame and Silver. So uh, eventually we will get to those as well. Now... Hamidi, they do have a nice distribution center here in the States, and they're also going to be opening up a store in Houston. So if you live in that Houston area within the next month or so, go down there and check them boys out. Okay, check them boys, check them girls, check all of them out. They should be down there in the next month or so. So Hamidi was nice enough to actually send me a few fragrances for review. And again, I want to give you guys the straight up truth. Okay, this is it day because they gave me something I'm going to give you. Uh, uh, BS uh, review. I'm going to give you a straight forward no BS fragrance review. Now, this one is part of that addicted lineup. And before we even get into this fragrance, I must, 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 must let you guys know that you guys can buy some stuff on their website, humidi.us, or you can actually look at Sterling Parfums because this is part of the Sterling Parfums lineup. You guys already know our moths, mothers as well. But go check them out right now. They actually got a buy two, get one free. BTG1 is a code that you can use to get uh, that buy uh, two, get one free. And then also, if you just want 10% off, you can use a code Thomas A. Lint. So I'll leave that stuff down below. Nonetheless, let's finally get into this fragrance. Again, Hamidi. Now, think of our moth. You think of some others that maybe Sterling Parfums has, but... Uh, Hamidi is kind of a, they consider themselves a luxury Arabian brand. So uh, you got to take that with a grain of salt. Now, some of you guys might come on here too. I think on the last one, you guys are like, man, you got you used to do the clones that were more affordable. These are a little bit more expensive. That is true. These are a little bit more pricier than your Armoffs, your the Tapas, some of those other ones, Al Haramain, uh, maybe like $20, $30 more than Al Haramain, maybe about $50 more than Armoffs. But these are still, still 75 to 80% cheaper than what they are cloning. So you got to take it uh, as that. And then also uh, using that discount code and stuff like that, save that money. And also go out there and use the afterpays, use the Klarna's, use the Affirms if you have to. Save yourself some money right at the checkout, okay? So don't be ashamed to use those things. But here we go. This one is Hamidi Addicted Intense. Now, as you guys can see, this box almost looks very similar to one Creed Aventus. And I'm assuming that's why this was the Aventus for her. Okay, this is the Imperial. This is the uh, Intense. Intense and Imperial, okay? So same Addicted lineup, okay? But this is Aventus for her. And if you guys didn't see this review, man, this was for her. But I wore it like it was for him. And I wore it all day. And it was awesome again these are going to be a little bit pricier about 90 to i think they're anywhere between 75 to 105 dollars uh pretty much all of hamidi fragrances okay so give or take again use that discount code uh and then we get into it but here we go now they actually say this is kind of closer to uh the original batch you guys know that original batch the one that's smoky you guys like that smokier aventus you like the pineapple, your Ventus, you like all of it. Now, we all know that, uh, you know, whether you want to believe it or not, Club de Nuit is pretty much, I mean, if it is an Aventus clone, which I don't care if it is or not, that thing is a compliment machine. Now, I'm told this is actually higher class, higher quality, 
and I've smelt a couple of other uh, Club de Nuit, uh, you know, uh, versions. The Parfum, I think I smelt the uh, the the Parfum Extract, and they're they're all really good. Okay, the only thing is, I kind of get bored with the Aventus uh, DNA. It gets uh, kind of boring after a while. You smell like this clone, that clone, that clone. Yeah, they all smell good. Good thing about them though is they are compliment machines. There is not one other fragrance in my whole collection that has gotten me more compliments than Club in the Week. I'm talking about on the daily. If I wore it, I was guaranteed at least three compliments in the day. So give or take with a grain of salt. But nonetheless, here we go. Look at that same bottle, okay? Same rectangular bottle. Okay, we got addicted imperial on the right and then intense on the left. Same nice heavy feel. Feels real nice in the hands caps look very nice got that nice design at the top okay we got one gold one black and again this is a supposedly an Aventus clone okay so I heard it's uh from what I've seen on one other video beast mode you know high performance good quality so let's get into it okay let's see what it's all about why distribution of juice oh yeah Okay, that is, okay. As we all know, some people don't like the harsh reality of Club de Nuit, okay? There's nothing harsh in this fragrance. None at all. And again, this is not me just trying to blow smoke up Hamidi's tail, if you will. This is literally, there's none of that harsh lemon pledge smell in the air. This is straight, beautifully concocted together. It's like a nice... A combination of all those notes you got your lemons you got your your citruses you got your pineapples you got your musk you got your vanilla you got some of that birch wood you got some of the currant and stuff like that slightly smoky slightly slightly smoky man Here's here's one thing about Aventus that, again, I think, and I could be wrong, again, as I've been saying in all of my videos lately, okay, what you smell on your skin when you smell here is much different than what you will notice in the air, okay? What that scientific reasoning is, I have no idea, but in the air... I have a feeling if most people actually smelt Aventus just straight on skin, whether this is really Aventus, maybe it's not, who knows? Maybe if this was Aventus and I just sprayed it here, I like it, but I'm not in love with it as much as I am when it's in the air. When it's out in the open, oh, this is a lovable, people-pleasing, mass-appealing fragrance, okay? Again, very well-constructed. Everything's working well together. And the citruses are there that's slightly smoky that pineapple it's not super duper pineapple-y like how you guys might think this is not juicy pineapple this is not like latafa rave where it's like that juicy pineapple that sweet pineapple smell it's not like that it's there got that citrus you got some of these nice woods in the background again this this you know again for what creative interest is okay whether you want to call it the king of fragrances or not um me personally, I like other scent profiles much more than a Creative Ventus, like even Blue de Chanel, Blue de Chanel. I even like Dior Sauvage, the, the scent profile. I like that more than Creative Ventus. But again, we all know our moths, Club de Nuit, doesn't matter which one you got. If you got the, the original, if you got the, the Auto Parfum, if you got the Parfum Extract, all of them are probably most likely compliment machines. So... With that being said, I'm sure this is going to be a compliment machine. If you guys are wearing fragrances based on you, you guys just want those compliments, you're going to get it from this fragrance. Okay, everyone that smells this is going to enjoy this. You are going to get unsolicited. Is it unsolicited or solicited? Unsolicited compliments with this fragrance. Again, I've gotten plenty of compliments wearing our Moff's version. And this, again, once you spray it on, there is no harsh smell, okay? It smells well-constructed right off the back. No lemon pledge, none of that. Just very, very nice. Again, a nice bright, it's nice and bright, citrusy. Again, slightly smoky, woody. I mean, what more can you ask for with this fragrance? Again, you, you got the beautiful bottle. 
you got a huge size okay this is like a i think this is 125 no 120 ml so four ounces okay so you get like uh uh like uh what is that point 75 uh like 75 point uh 75 ounces more or something like that i don't know like uh what is what is a 100 ml would be a 3.4 okay so you're getting that extra uh 20 ml if you will for about 90 dollars okay again you're gonna use that discount called thomas a lynn to get some of that discount you're gonna use btg one to buy two and get one free and if you spend over 75 dollars you're gonna get free shipping so you're gonna get free shipping regardless if you buy one you buy two you buy three you're gonna get free shipping now they do sell roll-ons as well they sell straight oils i think they sell uh other um beauty products as well so go check that website out again hamidi.us again I am not the biggest fan of Creed Aventus, okay? Creed Aventus, uh, whether it's Creed Aventus, whether it's uh, Mont uh, Blanc Explorer, whether it's this one, whether it's that one, I am not the biggest fan of the DNA. I like the way that it gets all the compliments. Yes, and when you wear it outdoors, you get that breeze. It is, it's a magical fragrance. It does smell very good. It's very head-turning, if you will. I'm just not the biggest fan of Aventus, but again, this one right here is dumb diddly, as Ned Flanders would say. Wearing all black. Got the black shirt on, the black necklace, got the black ring, got the black watch, got the black shorts, got the black socks, got the black shoes, and I got that all black bottle with that silver trimming, which is very nice. That is that intense, that imperial uh, is the gold one as well. Again, guys know this is the Creed Aventus. For her, this is Creed Aventus. For him, the man, this is, uh, they consider this like one of the uh, the harder batches to find. So this is more closer to that version. Again, I've never smelt the original, so I don't know what that's all about. But again, the pineapple, again, it's not super duper pineapple-y. It's a nice citrus, nice pineapple, nice smokiness in the background, nice woody, nice fresh, nice crisp fragrance, okay? So all that right there without that harsh opening as our moth has. Again, our moth, if you guys notice, has been creeping up on the price, even the EDT. Sometimes you go on a website and the thing's like $40, sell so $40, you got $50 more without the harshness. You get around the same bottle size too. I think the uh, our moths is actually 3.6, this is 4.0, so you're getting a little bit more in this too. So there you go. Again, that is that Hamidi Addicted Intense. Creed Aventus clone, if you will. Man, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I actually got a few more fragrances that they sent, and we'll get to those later on in the week. But until then, I hope you guys know what to do. Hit the likes, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Peace. Yeah.